Hey, I'm Decathlon Gamer. Welcome back to Founder's Fortune. This is episode number 28. Just a quick heads up. I do appreciate the extra likes on the last video, but the view count still uh, quite low, and so this is going to be it. Speaking of this going to be it, this is also just about it for Bridget Ziegler. Bridget now into the final day of her life. So uh, I'm currently working on a replacement. That is Christina. Christina, we've already picked up two levels of scholarship, uh, of scholarly training. It's going to take four in order to do research scrolls. So she's going to be studying up on that for a while. Henrietta, meanwhile, well, she just went all into a mood. But besides the mood that Henrietta is in, we've continued to train her up as a soldier. We've added two skill points for her. Sneaking is probably going to be a useful skill. Uh, she is an archer, so we don't have to worry about her sword play. And otherwise, she's just going to be standing around for a little bit. So currently, textiles maxed out 200 cloth. So we've got stuff to do there. The illness medicine is high. The healing plants is high. Uh, we haven't seen the trader for a little bit. Speak of the devil. All right, let's mm -hmm. see. What are you off to do? Yeah, I need my farmers right now. Christina. Why don't you do, go ahead and say hi. So we will be able to sell off uh, probably all of our illness medicine as we have plenty to make a whole new batch and I think there's still some to harvest. Christina, hey, you're tired. Okay, you, you reached him. All you gotta do is say hi. There you go. All right, huge amount of coins are very very valuable to us and you don't have anything that I need at all <laughs> yeah no nothing nothing so uh, we're gonna make some money let's go ahead and sell at least a little bit of this iron ore let's say 11 that's 800 coins. We do have space for that, right? Yeah, capacity is 1,000. So we have plenty of coins now. Unfortunately, we didn't get any scrolls. So we're still going to be short on scrolls for now. And finishing the research is a real issue. And meanwhile, Bridget, yep. final moments of her life, half a day to go. And she's sleeping this one off. Speed things up for a little bit. She will wake up to another day. Now for this final episode, I will do a bit of what I did in the last episode. Though I do intend this one to be a little bit longer than the previous episode. That is, we are definitely going to look to get some work done. We've got some potatoes being harvested. Bridget, you're a farmer. Let's go ahead and sow some pumpkins with your final day. Look at all that wheat, yeah. Emily, level 14 as a farmer. Goodbye, Bridget. Goodbye. Farewell. Stefan and Henrietta having a little attitude issue. Bridget, you don't need to eat anymore. Stop wasting our food. Working away on her final day. By the way, we have all that cotton, but nothing we can do about it at the moment uh illness medicine already coming back and boom there it is bridget has died of old age yep yep and we still don't have this because we've blocked this off i can't build the gate because i don't have stone 
I don't have stone because our stone mine is not functioning properly. I'm going to have to get rid of it, unfortunately, and replace it. It just, it's glitched out big time. Big time, big time. That is so unfortunate because that is one huge expense that I have to go through again. Uh, but as things go, it does make a little bit of sense to me. Uh, we, we've gone through multiple updates. 500 coins, 400 wood, 20 iron ore again just to get another functioning stone mine. We're going to go ahead and put this one right here. <laughs> they want our one and only stone. How nice. How nice of them.
Yep. Alright, Lena. We already gave you that big payday. I don't know why she's still not accepting it. But the couch and the payday would be enough. Oh, Constantine broke his leg. That's awesome. We're keeping our doctor busy. and You know, he's okay. The balance is good on a lot of these things. But there are a few. There are a few things that are quite difficult. That we just can't get out from under. I mean, this playthrough, I have gone to extreme measures to af avoid a fight. And Constantine, can you even help yourself here? There you go. Okay. I'll be able to walk in a minute. Mm -hmm. But this, you know, constant struggle. And then, out of all that, we wait. And we wait, and we wait, and we wait, and we finally get a colonist to arrive. And they're already on the verge of death. Why? Why would they send us someone so old? Now, I turn them away. We end up waiting an hour again. And I would have turned them away if we weren't about to end the series. But here we are. Not a small room, but it's completely jam-packed. And yet, here we are again, just trying to squeeze something in. So, bigger rooms next time. I, that, that's not a big deal. We're just going to go right there, right in the middle. Let's just make this happen. There we go. Okay, Lena. Discover forging. Really? We're going to deny another wish. We're going to deny another wish. We're going to deny another wish. You're going to be ticked. Your, your demands here, it's the same over and over again. So, Lena, go ahead. Have a mood. So I can't even get something reasonable. And we've already... I already assigned a payday to her, which they didn't. give her but they're taking our coins so I can't get to that point where I buy the elixir of youth to survive the old age I'd love to see what happens with that but every time we try over and over again they just ah, the balancing needs some work when it comes to that and honestly the biggest thing I don't mind the age, right? It's going to happen. It's 11 years, right? How are all these young people coming and being dead from old age in five years' time? That's balancing. Balancing. Just need a little bit, right? But here we are. Right? We're, we're down. We're only at 7 right now. We were at 8. We're only at 7 right now, and yet it's it's going to take an hour to get the next one. That's a few seasons. In that time, mm -hmm. Veronica's going to die. In that time, Emily's going to be close. Mm -hmm. Lena is going to be close. So they're dying faster than they're arriving. That's, that's the main point, right? They, uh, I get the aging, and I, and I love the feature. I love the game. So much fun. For me, if I were to choose one thing, one thing for the devs to work on in their next update, it would be the balance of that. Balance of how quickly they die of old age and go through that in just a few years and they're dead versus how long it takes to get a replacement for those that have passed away. I don't mind the balancing on the difficulty about meeting their expectations. I think that's 
relatively reasonable, you know? But it's the old age, and it's the colonists arriving that are already on the verge of death that you had to wait so long. Anyway, point made. Besides that, I do really, really enjoy this game. Uh, I can't wait to see what happens down the road. And uh, let me tell you this, okay? We might be done for season two. And I'm so pleased that season two has gone significantly better than season one did. We had a couple challenges along the way. We had new updates to things that didn't function, but then after future updates did function. We had things that did work, and then an update came along and stopped functioning. It's a game in development. But there's so much to like about this game. It is a game not only with tremendous potential, but it's a game that's pretty dang good already, right now. And one minor adjustment, in my opinion, would make it much better. But that doesn't stop it from being pretty good right now. But I am, at least in a sense, already kind of at a standstill. It's really hard for me to make progress right now when the only thing that can keep us from losing colonists faster than we can gain them is money that we're making at a pretty good rate now. I thought the beer was going to sell for more. I really did. I thought for sure that that beer was going to amount to a good amount of coin. Don't you think people would pay top dollar? In the middle of nowhere in a colony like this for, for beer, the trader. Should be 30, 35 a piece on the beer. No? That's a lot of resources and a lot of time and effort farming wise, production wise, to make that beer, storage space wise to make that beer. And they sell for fifteen each when the illness medicine man oh man, that is our lifeline on uh, in the colony financially. It pays really well, and I'm so glad that we went that route, and I know exactly where to go next time to start making money early. But when the pirates, your friends, who you have good relations, start demanding an average of 700 coins each and every time they come, that's a lot. Beer is 15 coins. Nothing else that we have sells for much outside of the illness medicine. And we're more or less mass producing. Oh, really? Our gambeson is done and you're going to take it? Ah, it's fine. I, we're at the end. Anyway, enough of a rant. There goes our coins. They keep... Uh, deterioration of relations, I think, is a little quick. Also, I'm playing on speed three, but I still think it's a little quick. You work so hard to build relations with the pirates, and yet... It's not staying high. Uh, we've only said no once this whole season, this whole playthrough. Anyway, there will be a season three because I like this game. It's not going to be for a little while. It's going to be after a number of uh, future updates bring the game you know, far enough along. So keep an eye out for season three. It will come, but that does it for this episode, for this season two. Uh, we haven't 100% stalled, but we've come pretty close to stalling. Progress at this point has slowed down drastically. Uh, we are down to the last little bit of research and the things that come with that. Uh, but for me, the frustrating thing is I can't grow the community when they just keep dying of old age, old age, old age. All mm -hmm. right, well, point made. Thanks for tuning in. Last time, be sure to hit that like button, but more importantly, if you haven't yet, 
please do scroll down, hit subscribe. How are you going to know when season three comes if you don't do so, especially if it's a while from now? It, it could be a couple months, could be more. It depends on when those updates come. Uh, in the meantime, be sure to check out my other series, and I have a lot of new stuff coming to the channel very, very soon, and that is the reason for this to make way. Uh, Grand Tactician Civil War, Total War Troy, both just started up on the channel, uh, PGA 2K21 coming to the channel this week, and then CK3 and a number of other games are going to be right around the corner. Uh, by the beginning of September, I have four or five new new series coming. So uh, do tune in for that. And in the meantime, thank you for watching this series. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Be safe out there. And bye for now.